Hey, this is Horner, and these are the instructions for the concept builder for the normal force card sort. Uh, consider the following situation and categorize it according to the relative strength of the normal force or the scale reading. So the category options include, and then they give you these. So I think the big key here is uh, you know that this should read whatever the force is pointing up, and then whatever is going down should always just be m times g. So m times g is going to be 5 times 10. So I know that that's equal to 50. Oops. Yeah, that's equal to 50 newtons. Um, but, uh, oops, I'm going to zoom back out here. So that's equal to 50 newtons. And uh, because it's sitting on top here, we know that this should also be equal and opposite. So that is 50 newtons. How do I know all this? Because if I draw my free body diagram, mg is down on this one, and then this one is going to be the normal force, and it is pointing up. And notice that they should be equal and opposite because there's nothing pushing this down really hard. It's not getting dropped on top of it, uh, those type of things. So here we're going to say that the normal force is equal to the weight of the object. If I had a finger and I was pushing down with my finger, obviously, this would get bigger, and mg would stay the same. Uh, if I had a hook on here, and I was pulling up, then my normal force would be less, and my mg would be uh, the same. So that is uh, just some basic instructions for this one.